Kyle Gibson, his last time out, said the glove side command, really everything outside of his breaking pitches, was just lacking. Was there anything you guys have found in the time since? Just not as sharp as last time out. I think every starter goes through that, where they're not going to have their, their A stuff every time out. I think Tyler last night, early, you just saw the, the fastball, the life to the fastball wasn't quite there. Kind of found it a little bit as, as the game went along. Um, and that's really, really normal. You're not going to feel your best every time out. you got to be able to make pitches and um, I thought Wellesley did a great job of that last night. Uh, you know, Gibby was trying that last start. Uh, he's been so good for us, uh, the way he's the, the breaking balls and the way he's able to locate his fastball. Let's hope it, uh, he's back on track tonight. But to Renz, is the plan to go back up to three catchers then? Have you determined that? Yeah. Yep. Everything's good with McCann then health wise. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, both those guys are healthy. Is going to report tomorrow or in I'm unsure on when he's coming. It just kind of happened a couple hours ago, so I'm not sure when the, the arrival date is. Is that something you liked, having three catchers when you had Dunboom up here? I think it's, you know, it, it gives us some options. We, The way the, you know, obviously Adley and then the way McCann's swinging the bat, it does allow us to, when guy, both guys are in the lineup like they were last night, and that's been, it's it happened a handful of times this year, to have a third catcher, um, you know, it's beneficial in those situations. Brandon, it's been a couple days uh, that Felix has not been used. Was that intentional to give him a little refresher? And, and if so, how can that help him? Well, he's been used quite a bit, though. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, anytime I can give him a breather, I'm, I try. And uh, the last day in. Detroit was unavailable because he pitched the day before and the workload before that. Then we had an off day, and then last night I wasn't going to use him unless it was a safe situation. I didn't want to use Cano last night either. We just ran out of right-handed pitchers that were available and tried to lock that game down. And I was, you know, when that game was at seven and then we were up six, I was just hoping that we could keep it there and hoping that we could or at, or add on. And um, unfortunately, it didn't work out that way. And I went to Bake. I was trying to stay away from Bake and Cano and have them ultra fresh but you just saw last night when bakes fresh that's different that's a different animal on the mound um hence the moonwalks and um you know i we've they've thrown a lot of innings so far this year i'm totally aware of that and i, I try to give these guys breaks whenever i can ryan o'hearn in the lineup tonight against his former team what what's maybe stood out I saw to the you media about around him in the locker it was you gotta ask him about his kc time yeah so cool for him well, good for, you know uh you want to give Mountie a day off, honestly. You want to give Mountie a day off uh, on the on the field and and uh, uh, you know get get O'Hearn in there. He's won the bat extremely well for us in, his, in the role that he's been in and got some huge hits off us off the bench. Did a nice job in a start in Detroit and uh, gonna give him a shot tonight. From your perspective, what is it like the first time you're opposite a ballpark that holds a lot of memories that you might have called home at one point? I think that this is obviously a special place for him, and you know he came up here, played four years here, I think. Uh, um, I saw him yesterday. Talked to a lot of people, grounds crew, other the coaches on the other side that he knows, players. You know, there's 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 a there's a newness, and there's a. a yeah, I think that there's it brings back a lot of memories when he comes back here, and like any player that goes back to a place for the first time, and and uh, I know Ryan's excited about starting today.